in one of my favorite shows, The IT Crowd, Moss develops a magical bra that is able to be the most comfortable thing in the world, hilarity results. But in real life, an 18 year old student from Mexico has developed a bra that could help detect breast cancer. And for that, he has won a couple massive international awards or one international, one national. Um, his name is Julian Rios Cantu. And he developed the bra after being inspired by his mother's battle with breast cancer, which involved her getting a double mastectomy and nearly losing her life. But it does appear that she did live. And the way that this bra works is interesting because when we are doing breast cancer detection, there's right now about two methods. There's self detection, which would be giving yourself exams, which can be not accurate, and then there's also mammograms, which um, are far and fewer in between. They're pretty good, but they can be very invasive and uncomfortable. And um, breast, pan breast cancer is something that you want to detect early because of the radiation and compression from the breasts would uh, be able to aid the movement of cancer cells to other parts of the body. So he wanted to find a medium in there, and with that came this bra. It has at least um, 200 small biosensors that can map the surface of the breast and determine um, thermal conductivity in certain zones. And um, it would also monitor changes in shape and weight. For one example, uh, if the thermal um, temperature were to go up in certain areas, that would indicate that there was more blood flow going on there and that blood would be feeding something, perhaps cancer. So this would be a great early detection tool um, in there. And uh, the reason why it needed to be a bra was uh, he said it allows uh, um, us to view the breasts in the same position and it doesn't have to be worn more than an hour a week. Uh, so in order for this to be effective, it would need to be worn 60 to 90 minutes a week uh, just to make sure everything's all right. It does seem like it would be a very comfortable alternative. And for this, he has won uh, the Averis Mexico, Mexico Award for Entrepreneurs, which has a prize of a little more than $52,000 to finish developing the product. Uh, he also won another prize in Germany, the Global Student Entrepreneur Awards, uh, with a prize of $20,000. And this is great. It's amazing. I really hope it ends up um, being completed and being available on a more regular basis to other people.